What's up everybody, Kill423 here from EpicCouncil.com uh, I am bringing you a video tutorial on how to recover your JR programmer from bootloader mode uh, Now here's what the, what the deal is uh, Over by the reset button there's a, a switch on your JR programmer uh, It's intended to be up or away from the reset button uh, If you switch it down to the bottom, that's bootload mode and if the switch is down to the bottom when you plug in your JR programmer uh, it'll cause the JR programmer to get stuck in bootload mode um, what you get with that is uh, right now I've got mine in bootloader mode uh, you'll just get a red light uh, I apologize for that the red light will come on but the green light will not and even if you no matter what you do, you won't get a green light. Uh, now, to fix that, we're going to go ahead and open up JRunner. You want the latest version of JRunner. As you can see, like I said, I got mine plugged in right now, and we should have the JR logo right here, but we get nothing. Uh, we're gonna come up here to we're gonna come over here to tools and go down to update JRP firmware now the firmware for the JR programmer is actually right inside JRunner so you're gonna wanna open up your JRunner folder and go down to your common folder now I'm running a version 2 so right here all the way down at the bottom, pick flash, uh, firmware 105, JR programmer version 2, and you're going to want to select that. Click open. Before you do that, actually, you should make sure that your switch is up into a, a, a normal mode, away from the reset button. And it's going through and reflashing the JR programmer. and now it's finished so now we got the JR programmer logo back and you should have your green light on on the JR programmer and you're ready to run alright that's all there is thanks for watching